Alrighty, folks, what is going on today, man? Oh my god, it's, it's been a frustrating day today. Um, we were playing Shiri Nui's though, so let's go ahead and hop into it. Um, I've added a couple of cards. I took out the Lone Wolf because I wanted to try to cut it down to like 40, 45 or something below that. Something, something decent. It was at uh, 40, uh, what's the name? It was at 48, but I mean, it's the three Lone Wolves. We can easily take it out. Also, I'm playing a tech card known as Penalty Game because, my God, folks, that card is so good. And I really, 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 really do enjoy uh, Penalty Game because what Penalty Game does, if you guys don't know, if your opponent controls exactly four cards in their hand, you're able to uh, either skip their next draw phase or stun them by lock, basically cold waving them. Um, and only them, they can't activate spells and traps uh, during the rest of the turn. So with Shiri Nui, since we need that extra turn to set up, we need that extra, you know, you know, we need that extra little protection. Um, mo most of the time, our monster effects aren't going to do it because we really don't have, actually, we don't have any quick effect monsters to activate our opponent's turn except for the level six. But uh, that that that's just it's not going to do anything against like link monsters and all that stuff. So the idea well, is not to quit, but the idea behind the um, what's the name uh, behind uh, penalty game is to pretty much set up our entire board, pretty much make it like like bring out Doom King and stuff like that, and then pretty much lock our opponents to straight monsters. And there's only one real deck that can beat you with just straight monsters which is um gokis but once again they still do need to like they still do need uh like rematch and instant fusion and sometimes they need you know this extra stuff to go off with so charge just in case you stop everything and we put it again we can stop all that and keep that from going on and then mostly every other deck in the meta requires um some form of spells and traps to be activated or they play a, a buttload of spells and traps uh and bas bas can do it as well because they don't they, sometimes they play uh uh, the uh, what's the name version and all right this is um decent this is decent to say the least <laughs> so i can normal summon this i could ditch okay i know what to do i know what to do here folks um so we're gonna discard and we're gonna send see this is why once again we need that extra layer of just stopping our opponent is because like hands like this and even if we don't have hands like this, you're not really doing anything to, uh, yeah, fuck it, let's just use Smith's effect. Um, you're not really doing anything to, uh, I guess, progress the game state. So you just really just sit in here, you know, just trying to build up the best board so where your opponent can't kill you. But most of the time, they'll just probably just kill you. Um, no need to, ch ooh, there's a burial. That's what I needed. That burial might be actually, that actually, that burial, blood ain't the only thing she's sucking. Oh! Sir, you need to watch. You need to watch this. You need to watch your mouth. Don't talk about the princess like that. She's a princess, folks. She is a princess. All right. So what we can do here is get back the Yuna Zombie because that is a tuner. Um, we can target this, and then what we can do is bring out a Goblin Zombie. No, we want to summon to our opponent's side of the field. Okay. And so with this, now we can we can do some uh, we can do some different things here. We do play Scoldy. And we've already used all this stuff. So, what technically I can do is I can burial these three back, banish, special summon this, synchro into the level seven, and then that automatic. You know what? That's what we're gonna do here. That's what we're gonna do because with that, you're able to set up pretty much all your plays. And I know what you've seen. You've seen the scoldy. Yes, we need scoldy in this deck because we need to. We need to just dominate our opponent right now. We need to get to where we're just comfortable in the game and comfortable in the front front of the league. What does this one do? See, this is the one that is so freaking cool. So we can go that right there. Shinui Smith's effect. That can add me. I think I want to actually add Saga here. No, no, no. I want to add this. I want to send a zombie to the graveyard. That's what I want to do. Um, you guys are going to see my play. But, um, all right, so then with this, we can use our second Mizuki to get back. Um, you can just get back this, I guess. And then now what we can do here is use all four of these, go straight into a young Skoldy because we need to recycle this hand. We need to recycle this hand, and we get a pretty much a draw of something. Let's see. There's not a penalty game, but there's a soul charge. Um, hmm, we don't need Gold Sark. This is cool. We kind of don't need it. Um, hmm. 
I think we're going to keep the Soul Charge. We can put Mizuki back because we don't play Zombie Master. We have to, I guess, put this back. Yeah. So we just have to put those three back. And then what we can do with that is we can go ahead and add ourselves the Banshee. And then with Banshee, we can Special Summon, put that thing over there. We're able to Soul Charge. Uh, let me see. I can Soul Charge. Wait, can I go Savage Dragon? Come on, Sunny D. Actually, no, no we couldn't Special Summon. No, we, we could have won Savage Dragon. Right? We could have won Savage Dragon. We could have did a lot of stuff with this action hand, though. We could have did a lot of stuff. We'll be right back. All right, folks. So, yeah. Uh, before you say, well, why are you playing? We're not trying to do the Skull Dread Draw 10. And we just need something to basically facilitate the hand. We need something to extend our plays because, like I said, if I if I, if I didn't play Skull Deed at that particular point point in time, what, 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 what were we were just going to end on to something random. And that was not going to be cool. What the hell is this? Wait, what? When your opponent activates the monster effect, you contribute their special summon card and negate the activation. Okay. This card is sent, you can special summon one thunder from your hand in defense position. Why would you do that? Okay. So we can go with this and we can just, yeah, we just have fun, I guess. We use that. We get out um MPA, he's gonna use that. That's fine. I don't know why you're playing Lightning Vortex. <laughs> oh wait, this triggers again, huh? Let me see. Oh no, it doesn't even work. Uh we'll get this. We'll get this, and then what we'll do here. We actually just go Necro. Well, actually, we can't. We can only special summon zombies, correct? Yeah. So we're gonna go Spirit Saga, and then what we're gonna do? We're gonna kill this first because you don't want to leave that one up. Um, for some reason, I thought this searches from the deck, but it doesn't. So that's cool. Then what we can do here is go ahead and banish this. Um, yep. And then use Spirit of This's effect to draw a card. And we're gonna discard Banshee right now. That's what we're gonna do. Then we're gonna end our turn because um, there's actually no reason not to do this because if he's playing recycling batteries, we might be in a little bit of trouble here. So now we got this all situated and I think we're good. I think we're good for right now. All right, so that's cool. That's cool. That's all right. That's all right with me. Um, Pan Hunter doesn't do anything. You can't special summon. I don't think there's any thunders that destroy. Why did I automatically go to Pa Hunter? What is the other one? The the one that banishes something from the graveyard. I don't know why he's doing this. I guess he's setting up all his monsters. He definitely Yeah, you can't even summon the other one out of your hand. Yeah, that was this bad, bro. Alright, so what we can do here is go this. Um, hold on folks. Um, and then what we can do is just get that out. Um, and then if we wait, we can pop, I think we can pop this whole board, huh? So we're going to, oh shit, not that. Then we're going to use this. We're going to banish itself. Yep. And then, yep, we're going to pop. Did I, I didn't do that. I didn't do that. I didn't do that. Why? Why? I really thought, ugh, fuck. Well, he has the highest, well, it doesn't really matter. We can just kill that. Um, so then we can use, uh, can actually... Might as well just use that. No, oh, why did I do that? No, I wasn't supposed to do that yet. Um, and then spirit, I mean, solitary triggers. We just bring this back. And this is not once return, isn't it? Yeah, it's not once return. So I, I get why it's once return. I mean, I get why its effect is once return, but it isn't once return. So with that being said, we can do this. And we're going for game, folks. And if you guys don't know what game means, game is, uh, is a fun thing to do. So we're gonna use that, we're gonna banish that, we're special summon this young man. Um, and then what we're gonna do here, let's go Vampire Sucker. Yeah, we're gonna get game here. I don't know why Boral Sword isn't in here, but it might it might go in here. You really don't need it, but yeah. So we're gonna do that, draw another card, activate this, 
Sad we hit our only what's the name, so that's not cool. We're gonna use that to bring back this. Um, wait, can we kill this man? I'm pretty sure we can. Um, can't go Necro Dragon. We can only spell some of that once, though. We can go to a what's the name? Be 45. Yeah, I think that's game. We'll discard that. Then we'll go into our girl, Shogun Saga. Bam. Use that. Banish that. Use that. Pop the highest attack. Use this. Um. Banish Smith. All monsters gain 300. And Smith. There we go. That should be enough. That should be enough for game. That should be enough for game. There we go. See, look, man. All we need is a turn. All we need is a turn, man. We get a turn. There's so many zombie effect activates. Like I said, man, the only thing really holding this deck back is the damn restrictions to the special summoning. But I like, as you can see, this card, I can understand this one. This one, I can understand. But since it's being new, they should at least give us a little... That, that bone. That bone to play with. But, whew. See, man. If that... Oh, man. If those are facts... Oh, if we can just unlock the special summoning things, we'll be, we'll be straight. All right, so here is one of those hands where we can just use all zombies to win. And I think that something that might be impossible to do because he has a pendulum summon of three. There's, there's that guy. That looks like one. Yep, that's one. Ooh, that's not good. What the hell could the spell and trap be? Okay, so we can either take this slow or we can go balls to the wall. So we can go... Mm, should we just go... Fuck it. Balls to the wall. Fuck it. Balls to the wall. Watch him strike me. Or ash me. Oh, it's not an ash. You're in trouble, sir. You're in trouble. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's gonna quit. Yeah, sir. That doesn't work. Um. So, yeah. He's in a little bit of trouble here. Oh, wait a minute. That's Gold Sark. What the fuck does this even do? Oh, any damage I take is doubled. Um, Spanish Spirit Master. Because we can just get rid of this, right? Yeah. Get rid of that. And then what we can do is do this. Send uh, Gozuki. Zuki then triggers. Banish in Solitaire. Special Summon this. That triggers bringing back my man known as Spirit Master. So we're gonna keep that over there. Gotta go straight into a Sun uh, Sucker. We we're gonna. This all could have been stopped if he just played it correctly, but he didn't, so not our fault. Bam! Draw a free card. Ooh! Now that right there took the cake. Right there. That that's what did it. That's that's what we're talking about right there, folks. That's why I love that card, man. Where are you at? There you go, Banshee. So then what we're gonna do here is activate this. Um, I guess we can get rid of Gozuki. Get rid of Gozuki. Um, and use that to send Bloom. Activate Bloom. He doesn't have a response. Go ahead and chain that Banshee. Nope, no need to chain that yet. Activate the Zombie World. Special summon this man, because he's the boss. He's the boss with all the flavor. What do we have in here? We have two. Activate this. Banish that. Activate Doom King. And this is why Penalty Game is just so good. Penalty Game right here will just uh, seal the deal. This is 6,800. 6,800 to Abyss face. And there's nothing he can do about it. There's nothing he can do. And then, like I said, we also have what's the name? Oh, this is the only quick effect. Oh, shit, excuse me. Technically, that we got in this deck. So, I mean, that's that. Then we just go right into a Splendid Saga. Just go right into a Splendid Saga. Even though we can't use our effect because there's no what's the names that's banished. But it's okay. We can just get what's the name back for free. And all zombies can't be destroyed by battle. So this is why, once again, man, this, that penalty game really just shuts them down. That first turn, that's all you need to do is set up on that first turn. And get just basically be able to go into your... Okay, there's... Oh, yeah, never mind. You play that, so... We'll do that. Um, nope, and then yeah, we'll use Spirit Master to pop 
this and then we'll chain this see this is what I'm talking about Woo! oh that, that's just delicious right there that's just delicious and we still have this and it can't be destroyed by battle or card effects right or fires fires can't be destroyed by battle in oh, synchro monsters never mind this don't even protect doom tree <laughs> I thought it protect doom king let's see if we can get one more duel let me, let me check the time real quick it's 15 oh never mind All right, we gotta we got we gotta come back all right folks so we didn't get to show off pit in the game but we will folks so stay tuned for that um, this is the deck list. Like I said, feel free to suggest any changes to the deck. Um, I need something to get. Ah, no. I, I, it's just I have to accept the fact that Chirinui's aren't just aren't just a inherently fast deck. We could throw some Vindreds in here, but I think I'm gonna be pushing it. I don't know. I think Vindreds really help out with the the, the Solitaire really really well. That's what I. That's the only thing I'm trying to you know like because I know that really helps out really well. Because if I go solid, yeah, bro, that, that is just an amazing play. And then we're just able to win from there. Because Battle Lord can shut everything off. Ah, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I don't want to just throw everything to a Vendred Park. Because, you know, that's just pretty much making the same deck 400 times in a row. But we'll see, man. We'll see. I might venture with that next week. And we just, like I said, or you guys want me to try to throw something together, we can go from that. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. We'll be back in a couple hours. So stay tuned. And, uh, yeah, man. Uh, be right back, man. Be right back.